I was a colicky kid and I used to cry all the time. My parents took me to a doctor and he said, just give him this. And it was phenobarbital, which is a major barbiturate and a very addictive thing. And I was 30 days old. And when he was 14, Matthew discovered he could numb his insecurity the same way. I finally felt at home for the very first time as soon as I drank alcohol. I lay in the grass and I thought to myself, this must be the way that normal people feel all the time. Matthew had been keeping up the act for years, but even while he was starring on Friends, his insecurity and addiction spiraled out of his control. I was taking 55 Vicodin a day. I weighed 128 pounds. I was on Friends, getting watched by 30 million people, being beaten down so badly by the disease. The best thing about me, bar none, is if somebody comes up to me and says, I can't stop drinking, can you help me? I can say yes and follow up and do it. When I die, I don't want friends to be the first thing that's mentioned. I want that to be the first thing that's mentioned. I'm going to live the rest of my life proving that.